स्टूडेंट्स आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन नाउ आई विल डिस्कस द थर्ड टॉपिक दैट इज अबाउट कंटिन्यूटी नाउ फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आई विल डिस्कस द कंटिन्यूटी एट एन इंटीरियर पॉइंट एंड एट एन एंड पॉइंट एंड देन वी विल डिस्कस द कंटिन्यूटी टेस्ट नाउ इन केस ऑफ इंटीरियर पॉइंट द डेफिनेशन सेज दैट अ फंक्शन वाई इज इक्वल टू एफ ऑफ एक्स इज कंटिन्यूज एट एन इंटीरियर पॉइंट सी ऑफ इट्स डोमेन इफ दीज कंडीशन दिस कंडीशन होल्ड्स मीन्स इफ वी सब्सटीट्यूट दैट इंटीरियर पॉइंट सी इन द फंक्शन एंड इट्स आंसर इज इक्वल टू द लिमिट मीन्स इफ वी टेक द लिमिट एक्स अप्रोच इज टू सी ऑन एफ ऑफ एक्स and it gives the answer same as f of c then we say that it is continuous at an interior point now what does it mean for example i will take the function f of x is equal to x square and i want to check its continuity at some point 2 we know that x square is continuous throughout its domain but i want to just show you about what, uh, how does this definition works like i want to check its continuity at an interior point that is x is equal to 2 now what i will take limit x approaches to 2 and apply it on a function and if its answer is equal to f of 2 then i will say that this is continuous at this interior point for example like here i substitute 2 ka square and it is equals to 2 square then it is 4 and this condition holds that's why i say that it is continuous at this interior point now how does it mean by the continuous at an end point now when we talk about end point continuous the came the idea of left continuous and right continuous and it is developed from the very basic concept of left hand and right hand limit for example when we were talking about the definitions of limits we also talk about one sided and uh, one sided limits and in the same way we can also check left continuous and right continuous for example a function is left continuous uh, at a left end point a or is continuous at a right end point b of its domain if these conditions hold for example if we approach uh, a from the right side and its answer is equal to f of a or if we approach it from the left side and its answer is equal to the left end point then we say that it is left uh, con uh, left continuous or right continuous means in this way we can check the continuity at end points now here i write that a function this one is continuous throughout its domain and we can also clearly see from its graph that it is continuous in this domain and the unit step function is discontinuous because it is right continuous at x is equal to 0 means when we approach it from right side then it is continuous at this point but not left continuous means right continuity exist but left continuity does not exist so it is not uh, defined at that particular point and left right continuity is not equal to left continuity now we come toward the continuity test a function f of x is continuous at x is equal to c if and only if it meets the following three conditions means how we can check the continuity at a particular point this test explain this thing that first of all we have to check f of c exist means we have to substitute we have to substitute that particular point in our function and if f of c exist then okay then we move toward the second condition that we check the limit there means uh, the existence of limit means the existence of right hand limit and the existence of left hand limit and the equality of these two limits and in the same way we check in the third condition that whether condition 1 gives the answer same as condition 2 means the answer of f of c is should be equal to the limiting value then we say that the function is continuous there and like i discuss here that f of, first of all we have to check f of 2 and then we have to check the limiting value and if this is equal to each other then we say that the function is continuous 
now this is all about today's lecture